We're now going to take a visit to the Greek Hotel, Eva Palace Resort. But on the way, we passed this delightful church. We thought we'd stop and have a little look. What a beautiful setting to just sit down and think about life and watch the world go by. Not that there was much to watch, it was very quiet and tranquil and quite nice actually. After a little rest outside the lovely church on this Sunday morning, we decided to then head up to the Grecatel Eva Palace Resort. This five-star resort is situated on the Komono Peninsula and is just 10 minutes away from Corfu Town. As you enter the resort itself, you'll find lots of mature gardens and lots of olive trees, of course, which is what you would expect. And as you go into the hotel lobby itself, you are welcomed by lots of antiques. Not to everyone's taste, but I quite liked the decor. It had a boutique feel to it. Let's have a look around. You used to have my hair like that. Now I must say the Greco Hotel chain really pushed the boat out and what a fantastic welcome we had. Lots of drinks and a few snacks waiting for us when we arrived. And just look at those spectacular views. Cocktail anyone? When it comes to food and drink at the Eva Palace, when making the booking, there are several options to choose from. You can have breakfast only, you can have half board, or you can have comfort all in, which is a little bit like all inclusive. As well as the many restaurants and bars here, you can also use other facilities within the Greco hotel chain. A speedboat transfer to one of the other resorts can be easily arranged. You can also arrange a transfer to Danila village to eat. This is a working museum and replica village of a 1930s Corfu town. And you may have seen it on such things as my big fat Greek wedding and also the TV programme, The Durrells. There are spa treatments available at resort and these have been inspired by Aphrodite, the goddess of love and beauty. Let's wander now down some of the winding paths as we wander towards the main pool. Views there of the actual resort. More mature gardens and plenty of olive trees. Immaculately kept. And here is the main pool. There's also a pool bar there. Uh, plenty of cocktails to be had. There's also a path down to the main beach. And there's also a brand new beach bar down there as well. In terms of the actual accommodation at the resort, there are guest rooms, there are suites, and there are villas. This is one of the villas. Let's have a look around. There's also plenty for children to do at this resort. There's the Greco Baby Club. There's also the Greco Juniors, the Greco Kids Club, and a Greco Teens Club with lots of different activities and lots of different tournaments and competitions as well.
Let's have a final look around the resort now. Don't you wish you were here?